Are you lost in the crowd? Carl Jung, welcome. Today, we're diving into another quote by Carl Jung. The world will ask you who you are, and if you don't know, the world will tell you. Imagine you're walking through a dense, bustling crowd with people moving in every direction. Each person you pass seems to have a clear purpose, a distinct destination. If you wander aimlessly, unsure of your own path, you'll find yourself swept along by the crowd, following the flow without a sense of where you're headed. This captures the essence of Jung's warning. When we lack self-awareness, we become vulnerable to external forces that dictate our direction instead. So, what does it mean to know who you are? It means understanding your values, passions, strengths, and weaknesses. It means having a sense of purpose and direction. Without this inner compass, we risk being shaped by societal expectations, peer pressure, or the whims of others. We risk living a life that isn't truly ours. Think about the times you've felt lost or uncertain. Did you find yourself clinging to labels or roles that others assigned to you? Maybe you took on a career because it was prestigious, not because it resonated with your soul. Perhaps you conformed to a social group's norms, suppressing your true self to fit in. When we don't define ourselves, we end up wearing masks that conceal our true essence. How can we prevent this? How can we ensure that we define who we are, rather than letting the world do it for us? First, we must engage in self-reflection. Take time to ponder your values and passions. What makes you feel alive? What principles do you hold dear? Journaling can be a powerful tool for this. Write down your thoughts, dreams, and fears. Over time, patterns will emerge, revealing your core self. Next, seek feedback from those who know you well. Sometimes others can see our strengths and blind spots more clearly than we can. Ask trusted friends or mentors about your qualities. Their insights can help you gain a fuller picture of who you are. However, remember to filter this feedback through your own understanding. Ultimately, you are the final authority on your identity. Consider the example of famous artists and innovators. They often faced criticism or rejection because they didn't fit conventional molds. Yet, by staying true to their unique visions, they made lasting impacts. Think of Vincent van Gogh, who painted with passion despite never finding commercial success in his lifetime. His authenticity and dedication to his art ultimately made him one of the most celebrated painters in history. Living authentically also means setting boundaries. When you know who you are, you understand what you're willing to accept and what you need to reject. Boundaries protect your time, energy, and well-being. They help you maintain your integrity in a world that constantly tries to shape you. So let's heed Carl Jung's advice. Let's embark on the journey of self-discovery with courage and commitment. Let's define ourselves before the world does it for us. By doing so, we can lead lives that are true, fulfilling, and uniquely ours. Thank you for joining me. If you have thoughts or experiences to share, leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more. Until next time, remember, you are the author of your own story. Write it well.